Mexico. It's about two and a half hours from, well, it's about two hours depending on how fast you drive from Mexico City. So here's my flight deck in front of me. I have my Vario meter on the right hand side. It's um, the beeping you hear is when I when I'm going up, and the boo is when I'm going down. So ideally, I want to stay up to be taking photos. Um, my Vario meter tells me my wind direction, my ground speed, um, how strong the thermals are, and several other options. And in the middle, I have a cell phone, and it's a uh, cell cell, which for me is great, better here in Mexico. It has better coverage than a lot of the other um, brand names. And on my left hand side I have my Nikon D800E with an 18 to 200 millimeter lens. I, this lens isn't as good as some of my other lenses for flying, but um, this is the one I tend to use most of the time because it's, um, it gives me a wide, a, a quite a wide range and I really don't want to be switching lenses in the, in the air. So I'm going to turn here, this is a thermal. And so ideally, while flying, we always want to have a lot of altitude. And so, and that's what I'm trying to do, get back up really high again, because when I take photos, then I'm not concentrating on flying as much. And I'm, you know, I'm going down, I'm not going up. So, I'm going to try and gain a little more altitude, and then I'm going to show you what I do with the camera. So I'm going up and actually my cockpit's a little bit too turned for my liking so I can't see the screen on my variometer very well. So I don't know exactly how strong this thermal is. It's it's a nice one. Uh, and I'm out of it. I have to get back into it. It's right here, so there we go. And we can take photos while we're in a thermal, but the thermals here right now aren't, as you can see, they're a little jumpy or bubbly. Right on. There we go. Right now I'm at 2,522 meters. Um, the launch that I launched from is 2,371 meters, so I'm up a little bit, but I'm Ideally, for taking photos, I like to be a little higher. I'm at 2,586 2, meters. I'm at 2,600 meters now. I'm at 26. 30 now. I want to get just a little bit higher and I'm going to cross over to the Peñon which is a nice rocky mountain here to my right. So I'm going to cross over there now because I see a group of paragliders over there and I'd like to get some photos of them. So I'm going to take my camera out of my cockpit here and of course I have it attached and what I normally do is when I want to change my focal distance first I have to unlock it and I don't want to be swaying back and forth like that because I have this altitude so I normally want to go and I take photos this way and I change the, as I said, focal length but I want to grab my, <laughs> my handle because that keeps pressure on my wing and it's really, really important to have pressure on my wing especially in thermal conditions like here in Valle de Bravo and so this is what I do put it back in here and I'm going to try and get a little closer now I'm down to 2,527 meters and I keep going down as you can hear my my variometer. I'm a little bit closer now. I see. a nice big collapse. <laughs>
gonna go into the landing now because it's a little bit too bumpy and and what I try to do before I land I try to um, connect my camera again so it just stays where it's supposed to stay so now my camera is clipped back into the cockpit so it won't go flying out now I'm just gonna do a spiral to get down a little lower <laughs> 